Hi folks, myself Abhilash. I am running an Excel blog by name excel to excel.com where you can see on the bottom of this video. Okay, and in this video, you are going to learn how to insert symbols to customize number formatting. Okay, you have custom number formatting, right? So, in that, how do you insert symbols to get this kind of output? Okay, here I have a database like list of celebrities and their revenues increased or decreased from last year. Okay, so here are the values which shows percentage and it shows if it is a positive number it shows up arrow and if it is negative number it shows down arrow and we all know the universal colors for up arrow is blue and the universal color for down arrow is red okay so how do we do this rather than doing it individually how do we do it for uh, entire set of data okay that is our motto for today first let us uh, uh, type the numbers here okay 87 95 94 87 69 I am doing it manually ok we can do it uh, in different ways to get these numbers here fine so this is the raw data that we have ok and uh, we want to get output like this the column C is the output that we got ok and uh, uh, let us replicate the same in column E ok here to convert number to percentage I have a different trick here just type 100 in a, in, in a cell and just copy it ok and select this data go to paste special ok in operation we have divide right just select this divide option and click on ok now you can either use control shift 5 to convert number to percentage or you can go to the format in uh, number format where you cannot see in this video but go to the number number group and uh, select from general to percentage okay that you can do it right so uh, this is one step and from here if there is any values which is negative it should reflect in red color right or if it is positive it should reflect in blue color how to do this just use control 1 to get into the format cells number formatting go to custom and here type here just type in square brackets open the square bracket type green close square bracket ok and 0 percent this is for positive values and for negative values again open square bracket type red and then 0 percent ok click on ok ok so we have all uh, uh, positive values so we will see the values in green color ok I'll just uh, change this green color to blue which is uh, a universal colors okay where is that let me type once again ok uh, just open blue 0 percent semicolon square bracket red close square bracket and 0 percent ok let us see how this works for us yes so we have the same color here now say for example we have a minus 25 here just I'll type minus 25 and see whether the colors are changing is it changing yes it is changing 
that's great now we will add symbols next to it ok just select it before that le uh, we will take it uh, we will take these two symbols up arrow and down arrow ok for that just go to insert ok the last icon that we have is symbols in symbols we have like equation and symbol I am using 2013 version in prior versions I think we will get only symbol I believe ok uh, just click on symbol here you have to select from font like symbols tab font you have to select Arial ok and we have uh, uh, a famous uh, font type which is webdings webdings 1 2 and 3 uh, which has symbols but uh, I suggest not to use that because it doesn't work here we have to use font called Arial and here if you uh, scroll down from here ok if you scroll down from here the bottom the bottom will find up arrow and down arrow just select up arrow or insert and then down arrow insert that's all these both are inserted in the selected cell now go to formula bar and select these two ok once you select this you have selected these two symbols select this data and use control 1 here in the custom you have this uh, formula right this this is the type of uh, format that we are using just insert this ok I will insert up arrow next to the blue symbol and down arrow next to the red symbol ok and now I will just click on uh, ok and before that uh, let me uh, keep this here ok I will just keep blue uh, symbol and 0% red symbol and 0% ok just click on ok see that's all you got it and here actually the symbols are aligned towards the left hand side ok uh, when it matters is uh, like say for example you have some values without percentage ok there is no percentage and you have some values like 2, 5, 4, 6 and see the symbol is also moving according to uh, the value the number of digits here ok and this doesn't look uh, uh, this is not uh, a proper way of doing it right see how ugly it looks so to keep uh, symbols towards the other hand side and the numbers towards the other hand side ok uh, we have a small logic just select this data go to custom and next to this symbol ok just give one space before that use shift 8 which is asterisk symbol after asterisk give one space here also give asterisk like up you have to apply asterisk and then give space and click on ok see now Okay, see now the symbols are aligned towards the left hand side and the values are aligned towards the right hand side this doesn't now it looks good right so this is how you can insert symbols using number formatting custom number formatting ok if you find this video helpful please share it to your friends and colleagues or whoever your cohorts ok and please help me in sharing this information to all your social networking friends ok so that is all for today we will see in the next tip fine thank you so much see you all bye bye